Greetings programs! I'm Young Napoleon and I want to welcome you back to my Hearts of Iron 4 Let's Play series. This is episode 3 of a future Holy Roman Empire run with no mods and all of the DLC. Uh, in the last episode we prosecuted the Civil War quite a bit. We've, we did a nice little encirclement, kind of, sort of. <laughs> we, we had a, little a couple of pockets here. They weren't as impressive as some of the ones I've seen out there, but I'll take what I can get. And uh, we are on the march here. We're making really good progress. We can pick up a doctrine. Naturally, we are Germany, so we are going to focus on the mobile warfare doctrine. And uh, yeah, we're going to unpause and let this continue. We are manually managing Rommel just to try and Sneak him around the flanks. Not going terribly well, but it is what it is. I might hold off here on a minute. Oh, that doesn't look good. So, you know, we're slowing down a little bit. I probably spoke too soon. Yeah, you can see a lot of his organization is dropped. Looks like we can select a preferred tactic. You know, I have never messed with this in any of my games. I've always just let the, uh, the AI manage it oh I see choice is permanent uh no okay uh, what's going on all right, uh, are we still on wrong? We are not, okay. Ooh, almost messed that one up. So they got 24 divisions. That's a small little look at all those they've got there. I think I want to let them stretch out a little bit just to relieve the first. Uh, okay. And then once they once they're done moving, we'll reallocate the first here. It's Rommel too. Get in there, Rommel. Are they through moving yet? Looks like they are. Okay. So then let's go ahead. Get back there. Okay, we're almost making good progress here. We are unpaused. Ooh, yeah, if we can cut them off here, that would be fantastic. Fandiliastic. There's a little bit of a lag spike there, but um, okay. So modified government. We've got the two. <clears throat> excuse me, the the two of these dealios <laughs> that we really wanted. Uh, are there any? I think. Let's see. Army org. Army offense. Maneuver. I would really like Rommel, I think. Attack and defense. So yeah, we will we will wait there. We're still insufficient. Oh right. Oh. Sweet. 
Uh, let's see. That should free up. Let's go ahead and... British Malaya? And our oil is hurting, so let's get a little bit of oil from... Huron. Just to uh, help out with supplies here. Oh, it looks like we... Did we get pushed back, or did they push forward a little bit? I can't... It looks like they pushed forward, I think. All right, now that's good. Come on, get in there, Rommel. Okay, let's go ahead and... Oh. Okay, so we've got a we've got a really good chance to cut that off, which we're definitely going to want to do. Uh, but we're going to need to be careful about stretching the first too much. So, Rommel. That's a river crossing. I'll send you right here. Okay, good. Now we will delete that so that the first can focus on that. Okay, good. And then once they get down here, we will send these guys just running down to Lewitz. guys in position yet? Not yet. Oh, they're going out to Berlin. Look at that. Let them go. march you through all of this. Okay. Okay, we've got our radio. We will go ahead and work on keeping our radar up to date. There's what are we waiting for again? I think I'm start I think at this point I want to save up for all of the Oh, I need to take the air safety before it gets to uh, too late to take that. That would be unfortunate. Okay, we got a nice little pocket there. Once that gets cleaned up, we will give the uh, first another order to Take Stetton. Okay, 
Looking good here. We're at war. Let's see. They are 63% towards capitulation. Good, looking good. Once we get them, we will assign you to that one. And then we are going to delete this guy. There's no bad guys on the other side. So we're going to send you up to here. Uh, let's see, who else do we have unassigned? Send you up on a run. So I almost used the WASD keys again. Okay, and then let's give the first orders to take Berlin. And now they've got a green check mark here, so we'll let them get at it as well. But they're at a more balanced manner, so they're not going to risk anything, it looks like. That's fine. Uh, we might force them to. What do they got here? Let's see what happens. Going on here. I got some units pop up. Looks like they were, oh they were probably training some units. That makes sense. Oh, we can set a focus. How oh, yeah. Good job. Way to go. Alright, so Hungary or Romania? Or autarky. See, these two are mutually exclusive. So, if Kingdom of Hungary is in a faction with Germany, uh, four military factories to Germany and Hungary, and they become a puppet, must approve of the agreement for the bonuses to take effect. Same thing with Romania. You know me, I like to paint the map. They are democratic. Hungary, on the other hand, is not aligned. But if I go the other direction, if I go for the German war economy, that gives me a guaranteed six military factories. This might get me eight, might get me four. That might also get me none, if neither one of them agree to it. Um, but I gotta get hungry into a faction. How do I...
can send volunteer forces. Central European Alliance. Create faction. Oh, that's down here. Uh, let's see. Not an affection, create affection. I don't, I'm not going to go that way. Uh, so let's see. What lets me create factions? Send volunteer forces. Oh, yeah, I'm going to have to join the allies first. So, yeesh, that's kind of... I mean, as much as I would like to try and get Hungary and Romania in as puppets, I think I'm going to have to go for the German war economy. Let's see. All right, we'll start with we'll start down this path because I know I'm pretty sure I'm going to want to get these anyways. Oh wow, maximum infrastructure. Nice, nice. So yeah, autarky is a good thing to pick up, anyways. What does the treaty with the USSR get me? Uh, let's see. Military factory, civilian factory. Yeah, autarky is a good starting thing to go after there. Now, what was I doing? Oh, yeah, Rommel here is small price to pay. Oh, looks like we got Berlin. German Reich was annexed. Oh, here we go. Okay. Here we go. Got him. Okay, the Civil War is over. Uh, which means these guys are going to disappear momentarily. So I can now click over to secure the new state. Which I really want to get started on. I lose a day from autarky, but that's fine. Okay. <laughs> These aren't the greatest divisions in the world, so we're going to go ahead and I think we'll disband them. Okay. We are going to... Yeah, so the best way they're found dead, hang them. The rebuilding begin. Oh, fascism gives me... No, I don't want to do that. Okay, so we'll go ahead and hang them. And then... Hopefully... The, um, once we get to the point where we have to right.
What's the word I'm looking for? Once we have to get to the point where we demand the return of the Kaiser from the Netherlands, we'll be weak enough that they'll be like, nah, nah, it's all right. We're good. Uh, in the meantime, we will send these guys over to our old enemy France. And we will send you to Berlin. And I think that's where we're going to call it for today, guys. So the war is over. The war is won. We are still the German military, German military junta, uh, which is fine. We're going to go ahead and, before I forget cancel that trade we got a lot of steel uh, yeah so we'll, we'll square all the construction stuff away when we come back for the next episode i hope you guys have enjoyed this as much as i have if you have please be sure to do all that youtube stuff as always i would take it as a kindness and remember sometimes you win sometimes you learn Hope you all learned something today, and I'll see you guys next time.